All right, so I wanted to talk about the top rappers. All right. Um, so I want you guys, this is 2020. I want you guys to Google. Just go to Google and just put in top rapper. And you go to Google. And I want you to look <clears throat> at who is at the top of the list. All right. <clears throat> and then I want you to ask yourself, how is this even possible? Now, I have some several theories on that, how it's possible. Um, I won't really get into all of that right at this moment. But <clears throat> really and truly looking at it, it's kind of ridiculous to think. All right, Some of the people that's there, okay, yes. But then this one person in particular that is there and is like, I think it is rigged. And <clears throat> what I want to talk about is how they do rig certain things <clears throat> and let me show you how now really and truly you are doing something you are doing something that is basically all right well, let me put it like this all right you believe in one thing and you are fighting for one particular thing. Now, <clears throat> you're getting tricked, right? Somebody throws something else in front of you, and you go to grab for that. But in grabbing for the second thing that they throw at you, you actually are leaving the first thing that you're standing on. And now by leaving the first thing that you're standing on, they're able to go and snatch it away from you. And you get fooled. You get tricked, right? And that's basically what happens and what's going on or oh, what happened because it already happened and I'm going to show you, I'm going to show you so now <clears throat> now a few months ago now there's a few months ago now maybe a year ago I'm not sure cuz time flies so fast but a while ago not too long ago um there was a song that came out and that song was actually promoted or released under a particular genre of music. And this particular genre of music wasn't really too accepting of the music. Um, so the people and the leaders of this particular genre of music protested against this song. And this song being labeled as, I don't know, it's crazy as, Lights in the sky again. Still, I don't know what these are. These crazy lights. I guess I'll find out one day. See, now it's green. Now look, see. Am I crazy? I'm not crazy. So anyway, <clears throat> so now this particular song, this particular song, right? It was not accepted, right? And what had happened was people protested and, you know, they tried to pull like the race card and all this other stuff like, oh, it's because of, you know, this person's background and that's why you're not accepting it in this music. That's why you're not going to accept this music. It's because of the person's background, blah, 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 blah. And everyone was fighting and fighting and fighting for this person's music. Which clearly was a different genre of music, but it was using elements of the uh, latter or former uh, latter uh, 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 genre. So, in using elements of that genre, they were able to say, you know what, this is of that genre. And to try to just flip it around and say, oh, you know what, it just has elements of a different genre, but it's actually from this particular genre. So... Meanwhile, so it's really from genre A, but it sounded like genre B a little bit. And so they came out as genre B and said that it only had elements of genre A. You know, they kind of flipped it around. And, you know, people were like protesting like, oh, you know, genre A is not accepting genre B. Oh, not accepting this guy because, you know, they, they you know, because of, of, you know, his background and, and that's why they're not accepting him and. It's unfair, and blah, 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 blah. Okay, 
Then what happens after that? Everything takes off for this particular song. And then they're like, you know what? Okay. People from that genre embrace it. Leaders of that genre embrace it. Embrace it. And they're like, you know what? <clears throat> okay, whatever. Fine, it's in this genre. Fine, fine, fine. We'll give it to you in this genre. Now there's a whole bunch of accolades for this particular genre. This song is one of the top, top, top songs. Wow, the colors is crazy, right? So this song is one of the top, top, top songs. And they're like, yo, you know what? Wow, this, this top, top song in this genre is unbelievable. Okay, now, number one song, number one song, number one song. Number one song, y'all know which one I'm talking about. Number one song, top, top, top song, right? Best song ever. And it's for a different genre, right? So now, here you go. Fast forward now. Not too far past that. Not too far past that. Him winning awards and all types of stuff for a genre that's not really the genre he's in, right? Because obviously the second song he comes out with it has nothing to do with <laughs> the, the genre he was complaining about. It has nothing to do with it. The second song he came out was specifically for the other genre. <laughs> so, either way, whatever. All right, so, so here we go. Now they accept him and they give him awards, all types of stuff. Now here goes the trickology, here goes the trickery. Here goes the trickery right here, right? Because... Here comes the awards now. And the awards for the genre that he should have been in and that they were complaining that he was in, but he was saying that he wasn't in. Now, for this particular genre, the awards for it, they give it to somebody else as the top and the best of the genre. They said, this is the top guy and the best of this genre is this guy right here. And these songs right here. And then those songs and that guy clearly in statements also said that he's not of that genre that he's winning an award for. He said, I'm not even in this genre at all. Don't even label me as that. You know? And the songs are clearly really not that. They're really, he's, he's very like... There's very, very, very little of him doing any of those or having any of those elements in any of the music. You know, very, very little of it. So, here he goes now. Right? Now, he's the top guy and winning the top award in that genre. The top award in that genre. Right, so now he won the top award in that genre. Here we go. The trickery has begun. Now, how can you complain? See how you got tricked? Do you see how you got tricked now? I don't know if you guys can see it. Somebody over there talking about me not dropping jewels and all this other stuff. Maybe you like this one. Maybe you like this one. The other one I can't really get into because I have no clue about anything. But this one is almost guaranteed. You can't see that you got tricked. You got totally tricked out of it. Why? Well, one, because people be using the race car a little bit too much. They be using that too much. You know, I don't know why. I mean, I know why, but... We have plenty of reasons to use it, but they be trying to pull it out the hat for every little thing. Okay, fine. Fine. A little bit, yes. Okay, we get it. But sometimes you got to know when to fall back a little bit. So now, they give you a taste of your own medicine, and now you're going to be tricked out of it. And they tricked you out of it. See how they tricked you out of it? No, it's red. Now it's red. All right, yeah, so you see how they tricked you out of it? But here you go. You was trying to fight for the rights of the dude. Like, oh, look, you know, he was going to be in this genre. Come on, just let him. And what's the big deal? Oh, it's because of, of this. It's because of that. And that's why you don't want him to be in this genre. And you guys are always against people like us. And that's why and you're not respecting it. And blah, 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 blah. Okay, now, they say, you know what? Okay, we're going to accept you. We're going to give you the top record. 
and we're going to put you in that genre and give you accolades of that from that genre. Now you're going to win awards for, uh, you know, a top record in this particular genre. And they gave it to you. Then, a few months later, <laughs> some other dude who's nowhere near the genre, maybe a little bit, the elements of the music a little bit, but lyrically, vocally, he's not in that particular genre that we're thinking of. But he wins top artists of that genre. Top artists of that genre. The, 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 the high, one of the highest awards that you could, you could get in music. He gets for that genre. And now, people want to complain. But you can't really complain. Why? Because we gave you one. Now you got to give us one. See how you got tricked? Do you see how you got tricked? You got tricked right out of it. Now here goes this guy who has nothing to do with hip hop. He says he's not a hip hopper. He says he's a rock and roll star. I'm not a hip hopper. I'm a rock star. That's a hint right there. He says I'm a rock star. And that was one of his hit records talking about being a rock star. And even in that hit record being a rock star, he still had, he still had elements of hip hop in that. Yes, he did. But that's because he just had a hip hop artist. You know, and when he first came out, he kind of leaked in on some hip hop vibe with his first big record that he had. When he started making real waves, you know. He kind of named it after a black dude. And then, you know, the vibe he was getting on was kind of sort of like hip hop, you know? And the way hip hop was moving at that moment. But then he continued to be not hip hop. And he continued to go with more R&B or more rock and roll or whatever you want to say. And he denounced being a hip hop artist. But, here you go. Now you got a guy. We came out with a sort of a hip-hop song, but it had elements of country in it. And y'all all complained when the country dudes was like, nah. See how they tricked you? They put it right in front of you and then tricked you right out of it. And then here you go. Y'all, y'all, they gave it to you. They gave them the top, top shit. But they said, I'm going to give you the top shit. But you know what? You're going to have to... You're going to have to compromise and say you're not straight. See that? You see how they did that? So they gave it to you, but they still took it away. They gave it to you, but they still took it away. Now you have to say that you are not straight. I don't know if that's true, not true, whatever, but that's what it is. I mean, because a lot of people, they don't ever, so how come all of a sudden he has to let it be known? Because there's a lot of people out there that probably are, but I don't see anybody proclaiming it. Why did he have to claim it? Why was that the first thing that he said? Okay, whatever, whatever the reason, okay. Whatever. But then now... You, they let, you had to let it go, right? They gave it to you. They took it away. Sort of. <laughs> but anyway, so they gave it to you. Gave him all the awards and everything like that. And then boom, then here goes your boy. Getting the top hip-hop artist of the year or hip-hop album of the year or something like that. One of those hip-hop, top hip-hop awards. He gets, and he's not even a rapper. He said he's not a rapper. But they gave it to him. Now, can you complain now? No, you can't. Why? Because he crossed genres. You did the same thing with the hip-hop and country. Why can't we do the same thing here with the rock and roll and hip-hop or whatever the guy wants to say he is? See? See how you got tricked out of it? Anyway, that's just one thing I want to talk about. It's me, Ken D, a lot for Browns and Roll. Like, comment, subscribe, share. It's cool.